got 10 rebounds. He's got a double-double. Stiakin the three. And a foul. And a foul. Team. And Bibby has gone 5 of 12. Page of Stiakin. And he's got 14 points with two minutes to play. Now, if you're Minnesota, the one thing you don't want to do is allow Sacramento to have anything good happen in this last two minutes. And you don't want to put them in a position where they feel good about going into game four. You want to have them totally discouraged. Bad taste in the mouth. Well, you know what? This is... She has to go into the basket here and uh -oh. a turnover. And Stiakovic and Bibby for three. Uh -oh. Well, Sacramento. Make sure you get a shot that hits the rim, and you don't want to do that. Turn it over. Well, Minnesota's seventh steal. Mike Bibby for three. It's amazing, isn't it? I'm telling you, the games in the NBA when you're ahead will never end. They don't have to foul now. They don't need to foul. 59 seconds to go. They're going to get the ball back. And Christie knocked it out of bounds. Shot clock at 16. Because they will take that in for the next game. Bibby has knocked in two threes tonight. 19 points for the Kings. Garnett. Stiakovic on him. Stiakovic was a great defensive presence against Dallas. And Kevin Garnett with a miss. Rebound by Christie inside. He's got 10 rebounds. He's got a double-double. Stiakovic for three. And a foul. And a foul. Kevin, I mean, this game has switched so quickly. That's why you can't turn the ball over. These three start going in. Streetwell saying, my goodness gracious, we're all right. A three, get a quick two, foul, and extend the game. Kings have a timeout left. And here comes Bibby. It's against Martin and Stiakovic for the time. This is unbelievable. This is unbelievable. Remember now, Cassell has fouled out of the game. When this thing goes into overtime, he's not going to be here. I mean, look at the body language of Sacramento now, and look at Minnesota. This is an amazing thing.